snow petals, so I'm going to take this Amazon box and using my pen, I'm just going to draw half of a heart shape. So now that I have this, I'm going to cut the tape off of the box and disassemble it so that it's flat. And I'm going to cut the heart shape out and place it on top of the flat box and trace it. And I'm doing this so that I can have two completely even and symmetrical halves. So you see me cutting rectangles out of the box and just put those aside because you'll need them for later. So now I'm just going to take hot glue to attach both of the halves of the heart together and press it together like that. And then it's time to decorate it so you can use pink acrylic paint and just paint it the way you want. You can also use spare fabric and glue that on top or even using gift wrapping paper and that's what I'm doing now. So with this glue stick I'm just going to apply glue, glue all the way across and then press it onto the back of the gift wrapping paper and cut it out. And when you flip this over, you'll have a perfect design with the gift wrapping paper. But like I said, you can also use fabric or just paint the design you want. So I'm also going to apply even more gift wrapping paper onto the rectangular strips that I was talking about. And I apply them on both sides, front and back, and cut those out as well. And I cut out about four in all. And I'm just going to glue these to the edges of the heart. And you'll have to bend them a little to get them to curve the way you want them to. And I press everything together to make sure it's really structured. And now I'm going to move on to the little shelves. So I'm going to measure out cardboard to fit the lens of the inside. And to make it even stronger, I'm going to glue two pieces of cardboard on top of each other to give it extra support and just attach that in there with the so clip. So I also paint them pink off camera. I do three rows in all and I also add these little ribbons to the front and I'm going to use these feather boas from Dollar Tree and place that all around the sides as well as a tulle ribbon at the top to hang it. And this is the finished look after everything is done. You can use this to store little light items you have like plastic, toy displays, figurines, things like that. So before I end the video, I just want to say thank you guys so much for 1,000 subscribers. A lot of you didn't see my community tab, but yeah, I'm really grateful. And I also want to start doing shoutouts at the end of my videos to say thank you, so just comment these emojis. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll try to post more. Bye!